हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू आवर एस सी डिजिटल जोन चैनल ड्यू टू सम प्रॉब्लम्स वी आर नॉट पोटिंग द वीडियोस बट वी आर वी विल बी लाइव कंटिन्यूसली इन दिस सेशन और इन दिस वीडियो वी विल ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड सम कॉन्सेप्ट्स थ्रू द एग्जांपल सो state whether the following statements are correct or incorrect in this example we will try to state that some points are correct or incorrect in the first point it is as when two positive integers are added we get a positive integer so it is obvious we can also see this with example this is plus positive integer and it is also a positive integer when both added it gives us 4 that is a that is also a positive integer in the second point when two negative integers are added we get a positive integer so this is wrong we can see it through example as this is minus 2 plus this is minus 1 but uh, when we add both these negative numbers so or integer it will result as to minus 3 which is a negative integer and uh, this point says that result is positive integer so this point is wrong in the second point when a positive integer and a negative integer are added we always get a negative integer this point is true correct through this example we can understand it as this is minus 2 that is negative integer and one this is positive integer and when both of them are added it gives us minus 1 which is a negative integer so this point is correct the next point additive inverse of an integer is uh, 8 is minus 8 and additive inverse of minus 8 is 8 we also know that uh, additive inverse of any number is the opposite of that number so 8 is the opposite of minus 8 and opposite of minus 8 is 8 so additive inverse of 8 is minus 8 and the additive inverse of minus 8 is 8 so this point is correct and the next point for subtraction we add the additive inverse of the integer that is being subtracted to the other integer we can understand it uh, from this example This is three minus two, and uh, we also write it as three plus whole minus two. This and this both will give us as uh, one. And in it, we can see that we are adding minus two to three, and minus two is the additive inverse of positive integer two. So this point is correct. so in the subtraction case we always adds the additive inverse of the positive integer that we have to subtract and the next point this is minus 10 plus 3 equal to 10 minus 3 both uh, it is not equal because minus 10 plus 3 it will give us minus 3 uh, my sorry minus 7 and 10 minus 3 it will give us 7 so this point is wrong seventh point 8 plus minus 7 in the bracket minus minus 4 in the bracket equal to 8 plus 7 minus 4 this point is also wrong as when we solve this problem this is the this step and this step and this step In the last step, we are uh, seeing that five is equal to eleven, which is not possible. So this is this point is also not equal. These are the some concepts based on uh, example. 
we try to understand and uh, let's try to solve some questions in this question question is can you find a pattern for each of the following if yes complete them so question a is 7 3 minus 1 minus 5 we can obviously observe here that 4 is subtracting continuously from 7, 3, minus 1 and also to minus 5. So according to it, it will go uh, and so on. We will get minus 9 here, minus 13 here, minus 17 here. In question B, at the same as question A, we are seeing that 2 is subtracting continuously from minus 2, minus 4, minus 6 and minus 8. So based on it, we will get minus 10, minus 12, minus 14 as answers. In question C, it is 15, 10, 5 and 0. We can observe here that 5 is subtracting continuously from 15, 10 and 5 and also to 0 so we have minus 5 minus 10 and minus 13 as the answer in question d that is minus 11 minus 8 minus 5 minus 2 we can observe here that 3 is adding in this question continuously that is minus 11 plus 3 equal to minus 8 plus 3 equal to minus 5 plus 3 equal to minus 3 so when we add 3 to minus 2 it will give us plus 1 and again plus 4 and again this is plus 7 in the last question that is 1 11 21 31 10 is continuously adding in 1 11 21 and according to it we will also do it so the next one is 41 and 51 and 61 let's try some questions of exercise 1.1 of ncrt book so we have the first question following number lines shows the temperature in degree celsius at different places on a particular day so this is a degree celsius temperature scale it is showing that temperature of different places at the same day so Lal PT is minus 8, Srinagar is minus 2, Simla is 5, OT is 14 and Bangalore, Bangalore of 22. So the first question we have uh, as observe this number line and write the temperature of the places marked on it. In the question A, we have not to do anything but we have to only write the uh, place names and corresponding to it as temperatures in question b that is what is the temperature difference between the hottest and the coldest places among the above so first is the in this question we will find the hottest place and the coldest place and after that we will find the difference between them so we have the hottest place as 22 degrees celsius of Bangalore and the coldest place as uh, of Lahul Spati and when we subtract when we try to find the difference between both the temperatures we will get 22 minus minus of 8 equal to 22 minus minus of 8 it will result to 30 degrees celsius so the difference and the answer of this question is 30 degrees celsius in question C, what is the temperature difference between the Lahul Spiti and Srinagar? So we have to find the difference between both the city temperatures. So Lahul Spiti is minus 8 and of Srinagar is minus 2. So when we subtract minus 2 minus or minus 8 it will give us 6 degrees celsius so the temperature difference between them is 6 and the last question that is can we say temperature of a Srinagar 
and simla taken together is less than the temperature of simla is it also less than the temperature at srinagar in the first question part of this question first we have to add the temperature of simla and of srinagar so when we add both of them srinagar is minus 2 and of simla is 5 when we add both of them it will give us 3 plus 3 and the temperature of simla is 5 so it is not more than the temperature of simla taken together and but it is greater than the sorry lesser than the temperature of srinagar sorry greater than the temperature of srinagar that is minus 2 in the last question that we will see in this video that is this is the second question in a quiz positive marks are given for correct answers and negative marks are given for incorrect answers jack's score in five successive rounds were 25 minus 5 minus 10 15 and 10 what was his total at the end so according to this question we have only add this five scores so let's add it 25 plus minus 5 plus minus 10 plus 15 plus 10 it will result to 25 minus 5 and this minus 10 plus 15 plus 10 this minus 10 and this 10 will cancel out each other because both are opposite and this 25 minus 5 will result to 20 so we have only left plus 15 it will result to 35 as a an answer so this is the answer of these questions and uh, from here that's it for this video and after it we will pursue in this chapter so thank you very much bye bye